for Calgary Greenway. Thank you very much, Mr. Speaker. Mr. Speaker, for the first time in about 22 years, the government is going to be borrowing for operating expenses. Wow. And at the same time, Mr. Speaker, public sector wages, Mr. Speaker, are going up by approximately $1 billion, as noted on page 22 of the budget. To the Premier or the Minister of Finance, do you not see how increasing total operational expenses, when you don't have the money to pay for it, will push further Alberta into a structural deficit? The, Minister. the, uh, the uh, situation with salaries, we did not negotiate those contracts. Those contracts were negotiated by the previous <laughs> government. When they come open, we will negotiate uh, fairly with our unions across the, uh, the uh, government of Alberta, and we will make sure that we uh, are achieving our targets in this budget. Well then, uh, Mr. Speaker, I will ask that there was a contract that was negotiated in September where uh, folks at the University of Calgary are getting 2.25% increases, followed by 2% increases. It's a three-year contract. How, sir, do you account for that? I ask questions in this assembly in the spring about your strategy on negotiations. How do you account for that raise that was just given? How do you plan on paying for all of this? Uh -oh. Mr. Minister. Uh, Post-secondary education in, uh, is a budget. We give that envelope to those universities. They negotiate their own salaries. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Uh, yes, they do have budgets, but the budgets are set by you, sir. And my question is, quite frankly, you have an allocated amount of nearly $25 billion for salaries. Is that going for new wages, for new employees, or is that going to pay for the wage increases for existing employees? Honourable Minister. There's a number of things in that question. What I will say is that uh, the uh, labour costs of this, in this budget are the most significant, uh, largest costs, of course. We uh, uh, have a number of contracts that are coming open for negotiation. We have to uh, meet our 2% growth overall year over year over year, and we have to look at our wages to be a part of that. We have to hit these 2% to uh, achieve our target.